Hey what's guys, welcome back to Lego Ideas Project of the Week. I believe that this is week 8 of this series that I run on the channel, where each week I take a look at one Lego Ideas project which is yet to hit 10,000 supporters, and I just kind of show it off on the channel and give all my thoughts and feelings on it. But before we get into this week's Lego Ideas Project of the Week, if you're not currently subscribed to the channel, then please consider doing so. I post all sorts of Lego related videos just like this one, and I'm sure you'd find them interesting. But let's just get straight into this project, it's called The Room 4 Old Sins Dollhouse, and was created by the account Lego Custard Kid. Anyway, let's take a look at this really in-depth designer's description. Um, as I'm not 100% sure what this entire film's about, as this project is based off of the Room film. Um, it's like a series of films which premiered in 2009 I believe and the fourth The Room film has come out I believe in 2018. So it's kind of an old kind of collection of films or a series of films. Um, but yeah, let's take a look at the designer's description to kind of get a better grasp of this project. So it says the iconic dollhouse built with Lego bricks. Following on from a Lego Ideas project based off the safe from the first game, in the Room series, I thought I'd try build something a little bit more ambitious. What is the idea all about then? The Room 4 Old Sins is a puzzle adventure game made by Fireproof Games. Oh, so apparently it's a game, not a film. I, that was my bad, I thought it was a film. Um, but it's available on mobile and PC, which features an enhanced dollhouse which within the game takes place. As one of the game's developers, I've often thought about how this would make a great LEGO Ideas project, so after all of the prototyping to keep the piece count below 3000, I created this digital build using the wonderful Bricklink Studio. So I obviously got a lot wrong there, so apparently this isn't a film series, but rather a game series, um, and this is one of the developers of that game, which is really cool, how he's creating his own project on the game that he created, which is really cool. Um, or that he's developing anyway. So about the build, he kind of talks a little bit about how the architecture works uh, and how it looks with the iron gates and the walls surrounding the house um, and all the detailing on that. He also says that this build has a detailed interior which has to be reorganized to fit all the rooms um, and make the best use of space. So I think that is one of his kind of compromises um, to keep the piece count below 3000 is he's kind of not being able to put all the rooms in there um, which is a little bit of a shame as you know each of the rooms is really really well detailed um, and it's got some really cool kind of details and little miniature builds in there um, but it's quite cool how you can swap them out and kind of turn or change the room and if you wanted to display this and you could kind of choose which rooms you wanted to display if that makes sense um, but yeah this this seems really cool um, this project is currently sat on 1,193 supporters with an entire 597 days left. So this project will most likely hit 10,000 supporters at some point in the near future because um, there's quite a few days left and he's already over a tenth of the way there. Um, but I will leave a link in the description down below if you wanted to go support this project or just check it out further, a link is in the description down below. As I said at the beginning of the video, if you're not currently subscribed to the channel then please consider doing so. I post all sorts of LEGO related videos just like this one and I'm sure you'd find them interesting. Anyway that is all for now, let me know in the comment section down below what your thoughts are on this project, do you like it or not? But that is all for now, thank you very much for watching, leave a like on the video if you did enjoy it and I'll see you in the next one.